In this they say at a point A 20 meter above the level of the water in the lake. So we are having a lake for example let me draw a lake like this. This is a lake something like this and 20 meter above this 20 meter above this somewhere over here. From this the angle of elevation of a cloud. So from the horizontal always you look for the elevation. So somewhere over here this will be the cloud. This distance given to us is 30 degree and this I assume to be h the height of the cloud from the this 20 meter point on the surface. Angle of depression of the reflection of the cloud in the lake at a is 60 degree. First of all the reflection of the cloud will be inside the water. Why the image from will be not on the surface but inside the water right inside the water somewhere over here. And you have to connect this point, this point to the point where the reflection is occurring somewhere over here. Now understand this part, this is a basic physics we know. What is the basic physics? We understand that above the surface, whatever is the distance, above the surface, whatever is the distance, the image form will be same distance below the surface of the water. So this is 20 for me. So this entire distance will be h plus 20, this distance below the water. h is this much. This is our h over here and 20 is very simply this distance. Fine. So we have all the measurement and 60 degree over here is our 60 degree over here is our the distance of a distance of the cloud from a distance of the cloud from a. So if I say this is the point a if I say this is the point a. Now they are asking they are asking uh, the distance of this distance of this. AC is something we need to calculate if this point is A if let me name this point somewhere over here as C. So AC is something which I want to calculate. Alright let me talk about uh, both of the triangles. So let me take the below triangle first. So 10 of 60 degree will be what? 10 of 60 degree this is the 60 degree angle. So this is our perpendicular this is our base. Base I, base I don't know so let me assume it to be except the moment. So this is H plus 20 plus 20 perpendicular part and below base is x. This is root 3 is equals to h plus 40 upon x. From here x calculated is h plus 40 upon x. Fine. Not x sorry root 3. Root 3. Then then we have the upper triangle. In the upper triangle we have 10 of 30 degree. 10 of 30 degree. 10 of 30 degree I am assuming to be 10 of 30 degree I am assuming to be h by h by x. So from here x value is very simple h root 3 or root 3 s whichever you want to say. I have the value of x. Let me equate 1 and 2. This is the favorite thing which you do every time. Equate 1 and 2. When you equate 1 and 2 this is h plus 40 upon root 3 equals to h root 3. So root 3 goes on the other side 3h. 3h minus h. 3s minus h that is 2h. 2h is equals to 40. So from that h comes out to be 20 h value we have calculated to be 20 meters. If I have the value of h now AC is very simple. Why? Because if h is there or I would have calculated x also then it will also be helpful. So over here sin of 30 degree, sin of 30 degree will be what? h upon AC the hypotenuse and sin of 30 degree is 1 by 2. The value of h I have calculated as 20 upon AC. From here the value of AC comes out to be what? AC comes out to be 2 into 20 that means 40 meter our final answer which is option number 3 over here.